I'd like to draw your attention to something that you may have noticed in chapter 6a. So in some of the questions, you would have noticed that some of the triangles could have had more than one angle, which would result in their area, which was given. So in example two on page 147, we are given this triangle, ABC, and we're told that side length AB is 11 centimeters and side length AC is 10 centimeters and that the triangle has an area of 50 square centimeters. Now, if we are to find the angle, theta, the included angle, we could apply our formula, area equals half BC sine of A. Now, something important to realize is that sine of theta is actually always equal to sine of 180 minus theta. So therefore, the numerical value of sine 30 is actually equal to sine 150. So what you may realize when you look at this is that, well, that means that I can have two angles that will result in the same area, sine of theta and sine of 180 minus theta. So let's have a quick look. If I was to try and find unknown angle theta and apply it using this, I would want to have my, uh, I would want to rearrange so A is by itself. So... 50 is equal to, so the area which is 50 is equal to half times B which is 10 times C which is 11 times sine of theta and if we're to rearrange we know that sine of theta is going to be equal to 2 times 50 over 10 times 11 which is equal to 100 over 110, which is 50 over 55. Therefore, theta is equal to the inverse sine of 50 over 55, which is equal to 65.4 degrees. So we know that angle theta of 65.4 degrees would give me, would result in an area of 50 centimeters squared. However, remember, we know that sine of theta is equal to sine of uh, 180 minus theta. Therefore, whatever the angle 180 minus theta is equivalent to, which would be 114.6 degrees, we could also have an angle of 114.6 degrees which would result in the same area. So what would that mean? It would just mean that we could have a triangle that still has side lengths 10 and 11, but now the angle, the included angle is obtuse. So if it looked something more like this, where the included angle is 114.6 degrees, this could be 10 centimeters, and this being 11 centimeters, this would also result in an area of 50 centimeters squared.